A surprising aspect um, of the exhibition is the links between the Pre-Raphaelites and um, the music of the time. Um, it turns out that Ford Maddox Brown was a very keen, um, he liked to sing, and his daughter Catherine was very musical um, and would, accompany, would, would play the piano at the musical soirees. So in 1865, when the family moved into this grand residence in Fitzroy Square, they would throw parties, lively parties, and they'd have musical soirees. We learned from Maddox Brown's uh, memoirs that um, his future son-in-law, Francis Hoofer, introduced him to the music of um, Carmen, uh, Bisset's Carmen. This is one of the uh, aspects of the exhibition, this is bringing something new to the, to the, um, to the fore, um, is this connection with musical London. Catherine marries uh, Francis Hoofer, who was a, a German music scholar, um, who she sort of met through, her, through these um, bohemian circles um, and these soirees. But it would also then take her, after her marriage, it would take her into the heart of musical London. He became the musical critic for the Times in 1879. And he's actually credited with um, introducing the, opera, uh, the music of Wagner to Queen Victoria. So he's a very, um, he's a very eminent uh, person within musical scholars. And through that, uh, Catherine meets um, people like the Italian opera singer Adelina Patti. She also, uh, Wagner also comes, uh, comes to be entertained at their house. Um, so you get this extraordinary, she's at the heart of both Bohemian society and um, musical London. And one of the lovely things about the painting at the opera is it captures the family's interest in going to the opera. We know that they used to go in state, all dressed up, to attend the opera. So this painting was obviously inspired um, by their musical interests. Um, and one of Lucy's paintings of the duet, again, features Catherine playing the piano. There is this very strong connection between music and pre-Raphaelite art that this exhibition will help um, to highlight um, once again.